Spirit Quartz from the home of the Spirit Quartz Bukenaut Hook uh, in Pumalanga, South Africa, P in Pumalanga province. Um, I think the, 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 the town itself, we're talking about Kwama Shlangu in Serans, which is about 80 kilos south, south uh, uh, northeast of Johannesburg, uh, Midrand associated, close to Pretoria as well, uh, east of Pretoria. Uh, we have central quartz crystal, quite typical to this deposit, surrounded by the smaller quartz crystals. Now when we look into the crystal faces, and we especially look into the main crystal, just to give us a, a good size, um, you'll see there's a rim of uh, amethyst on the inside edge, and this is, this is duplicated right through the specimen. The matrix is a solid quartz, and here on this cross section we have what typically happens at this uh, deposit, where you have the central quartz crystal with a a, a crown of or a, a crust almost of uh, 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 smaller quartz crystals around it. Um, apparently, on the esoteric side, these are good for family units and and units uh, unity among people. Uh, the, the gathering of crystals. And this is all the way from South Africa. Now from a display point of view, we would display this one flat mainly, going around on a turntable like this. Lovely little guy. Um, the, the camera and even the still pictures don't do the color justice. It's actually an intense uh, amethyst, a very, very bright, lustrous amethyst, and a lustrous specimen as, at that. Not very large though. I think here we're looking at about uh, maybe maybe just four centimeters or just under, so just over inch inch point five, round about there.